Hi, this is Robin Bremer on Walks with God, and I'm getting ready to go for my walk, and I'll turn the camera on as soon as God talks to me. Okay, today I've been meditating on the scripture, Psalms 45, 6, that says, A scepter of righteousness is the scepter of your kingdom, and you love righteousness and hate wickedness. Therefore, God, your God, has anointed you with the oil of joy, or the oil of gladness above all your companions. But I said, why did you reward him with the oil of joy? And he didn't, he said, I trusted him. He didn't say he rewarded him. He said that he had the oil of joy because he trusted him. I thought that was interesting. Interesting. And he brought me to the scripture. The kingdom of God is righteousness, peace, and joy. Okay, righteousness is our right standing with God. And uh, that's the first thing we have to have. Righteousness and, and peace and joy. And joy is strength. And it just, it, it's such a big puzzle that fits together in so many different directions. But the joy, the joy of the Lord is our strength. And God said that the kingdom of God is righteousness, peace, and joy because joy is joy and rejoicing and laughter. And, and he says the foolishness of this world, he uses that to confound the wise. And Jesus was anointed with the Holy Spirit and power, but the kingdom of God is righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Spirit. So he said that Jesus was anointed with the oil of joy, and that's what destroyed yokes and bondages. That's the anointing oil that Jesus had on him and we have on us to destroy yokes and bondages. Uh, because the kingdom of God, it's all in the Holy Spirit. And, and so he just kind of like pulled it all together and said he took the foolishness of the world to confound the wise. So he uses the anointing of oil on us in order to break bondages and yokes, which is laughter and joy, which people get upset about because it's foolishness to the world. So he uses that to break uh, bondages, burdens, and destroy things that have you bound up. And so next time you see somebody laughing, drunk in the Holy Spirit, uh, just laughing and having a good time in the Lord, don't be critical of it. It's things in their life are being destroyed because that is the anointing that was on Jesus that destroyed all of the curses on them of the world. And uh, I, I kind of went in circles today. Sometimes God tells me so much it's uh, really hard to put it into words. Uh, and to get the scriptures together with it that he tells me because in a moment of a second He tells me something that takes me five minutes to explain So anyway, um, this is day number 31 of my video logs on Saturday And you have a blessed day and I'll talk to you Sunday